We will now start by washing our clams. I have with me over here one and a half kilograms of clams. When you're choosing your clams, make sure they are shut like this, okay? And not open up, that means they are still alive, all right? And clams are basically harvested from either mud plains or sand banks, so we need to wash them. Just massage them well. Keep washing them like this. You can see that the water is very muddy. Right, we'll wash this and rinse this a few times until the water runs clear. Now some of the clams are broken up like this. We don't use this anymore because we are afraid that they are spoiled. Just throw them away. So if the water is running clear like this, right, that means the outer shell is very clean already. We will now proceed to soak our clams. Put the clams in a strainer like this. Why? It's because when they open up and spit out the sand, it's easier for you to clean it later. So we add in about two teaspoons of salt. Put water in. Make sure you cover up the clams. Now sometimes in some videos, they might tell you to add a little bit of oil or even um, to add in a little bit of uh, chili inside here just to irritate the clam so that they will open up faster. I've tried all methods and basically there's not too much of a difference. Now what I would like to do is I'll add in some ice to regulate the water temperature. And we'll soak this for 45 minutes to an hour and I'll see you back in a while. We have soaked the clams for an hour. Let's just have a look. Right, you can see that there are all these residues that came out from the clams. Now we'll just give this a final rinse. And now it's time to put our dish together.